word of my visions reached the church, and I was asked to accompany a priest to an abbey in Romania. You guys shot on location in Romania, correct? Yes. Correct. Did that kind of creepy setting sort of help set the tone for the film at large overall? Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. It's, you know, it's amazing to be able to film on location where your film is actually set. And, you know, Romania is so beautiful and it, it's so eerie and gothic. I mean, you know, Transylvania is the, the home of Dracula. So having that, that base and to set up our landscape, it just, it makes the film, it makes our job as actors easier. Well, I think it was, when you read the script, it comes across, you know, you're reading a story and it says, oh, you know, they turn up and they go through the, um, the forest and then they look across and they see this ancient castle and then they go in the castle and there's a courtyard and there's a, you know, a tomb room and then she walks down a corridor to a church. And it's fine when you're reading it, but then you're like, okay, now I'm gonna make it. Where do we start? We, you know, we couldn't build the whole thing. Um, and and it's set in Romania. It's, it feels like if you can start off with as authentic, real locations as possible, it, it sort of somehow bleeds in through and makes it to the end of the screen at the end of the process. So it was, um, but also, you know, we were making a kind of classic, old school, gothic horror movie. And so to find yourself actually in the mountains of Transylvania in a gothic castle, it's half the job's done. <laughs>